Hey guys, it's Charisma and today is content day. I'm filming for a brand. I'm just getting dressed. So make sure you don't just getting dressed. Um, yeah, so I want to just give you an idea of what my process is when I'm filming for brands. Basically, um, the brands tell you what it is that they're looking for, what shots that they want, if they want photographs as well. Um, and you know, basically the thought behind like what the campaign is. So today I'll be shooting for um, a lingerie company. I worked with them before and they want to work with me again and I'm and it's bloomers so these are the products that they sent so basically they sent me a little card saying thanks so much for working with us again and they want to know if i can do three looks one for boy shorts briefs and biker shorts so in the beginning when i was asked to do this campaign i was a little iffy because i'm like lingerie i don't want to show you know whatever i want to be respectful whatever but then i started to look at some of the other people who did it and they do it in such a respectful way um and you know you're not really showing much so when i did the first one i was like okay this is easy and I really did it in a way where it really looks really really nice it's not you know overtly sexual or any anything like that so I'm excited to be working with them again only thing this time now I have to create three looks so I'm not sure if that means I guess it does mean like to change what I'm wearing based on the shorts so that's what I'm gonna do right now and I'm gonna just um yeah I'm gonna do that right now so since they want product pics, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take pictures with the products first. They sent me an extra one. I have four. <laughs> I have four, um, but I only need to do three, and I guess one is extra. So I'm gonna take the product pics first, and then I'm gonna do the video. And this one is only for a 30 second video, um, and I'll probably be doing voiceover. So I'm just gonna get all the shots. I'm bit. Um, I'm a bit crunched for, well, I'm not really crunched for time, but I got other things that I want to do. And as you're becoming a content creator, a brand ambassador, an influencer, you're going to start to see like, okay, in the beginning, it's going to feel like really overwhelming. Like, oh my gosh, when can I find time to do this? Like, it just seems like an inconvenience in your schedule when you're just starting out when you haven't done anything before. But as you do the videos, as you're learning to work with different brands and stuff like that, you're gonna find a way that works for you where when they send you the information about what you're gonna shoot for, you're gonna know in your mind from experience, okay, I'm gonna, like for me, I already, I, for me, I already see the picture in my mind about how I'm gonna go about shooting it so that it can be easy for me and because sometimes you will be the one editing and doing all that, you wanna film it in a way. So you're gonna, over time, having experience, you're gonna be like, okay, I'm gonna do this first, this second, this third. And for me, what I like to do is write down a shot list, write down everything I'm doing, and I try to get more footage than I need, but I'm starting to learn too not to do too much of that because then I have too much to look at to edit down. So now I try to get close to exactly what I need, maybe a few safety shots, but less is more so that when I'm editing, I can boom, 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 one, two, three. So let's get some product picks first. Okay, so these are the, this is the lingerie, and this is these are the biker shorts. These are the um, boy shorts, and these, they sent me two briefs. So I guess I'll use the red one because that stands out, and these two, I just have because I have one of each so I have to do those but I have a choice between the red and black because they're the same in terms of the briefs so I'll do the red and then I hold on to this because they said that this was extra so I guess I'm gonna be creating looks for these this one is gray this one is red and this one is pink so actually what I'll do is see if I can find some robes to match and or and or t-shirts so I can create three totally different looks really quickly I'm really trying to um, test myself to see if I can do this in an hour hour and a half in terms of getting the footage the photos and the video 
And as a matter of fact, while I have them laid down on the bed like this, I'm gonna actually do video of the actual products separately so that I'll have that already done and then I can just do the video of me wearing them. See, I'm just thinking about this right now to make my life easier as well as vlogging for you guys. So I want you guys to give me a thumbs up and a like, Um, yeah, thumbs up is a like and comment in the video hmm i'm trying to think what can you guys comment comment boy shorts that way i know you guys watch the full video and you true blues people who have been with me people who have been commenting interacting with my content you know i love you guys and i will have some giveaways coming up but thank you so much all right let's get these shots so this is what i'm thinking for the outfits for the boy shorts i'm thinking about wearing this t-shirt that has the leopard print eyes which was in my Shein haul. I have a matching robe so I think that's going to look really really cute. For the briefs, the red briefs, I'm thinking of a black camisole with this white silky robe. And for the biker shorts, I'm thinking about wearing a white camisole with a robe on top. I just can't find the robe so I may have to just wear this one that I have on. It's hot pink so it'll probably work. So I ended up not wearing all the outfits. Like I thought I was gonna wear my leopard print robe but I didn't wear that. I did end up wearing this robe for one of the shots and yeah it was just three different um lingerie that i had to wear so one of them i did wear with this one i did with the pink t-shirt and then one i did with the white camisole yeah i did one with the white camisole so this is the only robe that i wore and these robes came in handy if you saw my um Shein haul these robes definitely came in handy i grabbed a couple of them and i think i'm gonna get some more because it just makes my life so much easier when it makes my life so much more easy when i'm working with beauty brands doing um skincare stuff like that so i'm so so excited hey guys so i'm done getting all my shots this took a little bit longer than I thought it would because they wanted such specific stuff in terms of different outfits so that's why it took longer and I did not complete it in an hour. It took three hours. Why? Because this one actually wanted product pictures. Um, some of them just want video so and in just one outfit so those are quicker so I think this is the first time that I had to do change of outfits and then photo product photos I'm sorry I can't talk right now product pics and stuff like that but I'm done hopefully everything is well so um I'm gonna break to eat and do some things that I need to do and then I'll probably do the voice over tonight and probably submit it tonight or submit it the next day so yeah that's how it is being a content creator influencer um this was definitely very, very fun. I love the lingerie. What's awesome is that I get to keep the product and I get paid to do what I love to do. So for 2023, I'm definitely looking forward to more sponsorships, higher paying sponsorships, and working with so many more brands. Um, yeah, that's about it. If you guys have any questions, just leave them in the comments. Like and share the video and follow me on Instagram because that's where I pose and post all of my reels and stuff on my Instagram. My Instagram is popping, guys. Instagram is right here. I'm going to leave it here. Also, follow my um, business Instagram because the lip gloss that I had on is my pink strawberry and that's what's on right now. I'm going to show you guys. This is one of my face because it, it smells so good. It smells like strawberries and... I just love it. It sells out really, really quickly. I am in the process of rebranding. So new lip glosses, new products for the new year. But until then, you can still support the website, charismaforyou.com. You can still support my Etsy shop, which sells satin bonnets, satin head wraps, scarves, all types of headgear. Etsy.com slash shop slash charisma for you. And that's it, guys. I love you all. Today's shoot was so fun. I'm excited and I'll keep you posted.